big development in the Jesse Smollett investigation. Chicago police have arrested two suspects in the case, believed to be the two men spotted in that security camera footage the night of the incident. Here's what we've learned about the two bodybuilding brothers now being questioned. The Jesse Smollett investigation is taking a shocking turn with the arrest of these two men. Both know Smollett and have appeared on his TV show, Empire, as bid actors. Detectives have probable cause that they may have been involved in an alleged crime, a police spokesman said. 25-year-old Abel Osandairo and his brother Ola, 27, live seven miles from where Smollett claims he was the victim of a racial and homophobic attack last month. Look, the Nigerian-born brothers are seen in this social media posting wearing black face masks, similar to those described by Smollett. I love the game. I love the hustle, man. This is Ola's audition tape, and he doesn't just act tough. We've learned that Ola pled guilty to aggravated battery in 2011. Ola played a prisoner in a scene with Taraji P. Henson and Terrence Howard in season two of Empire. He's also appeared in the TV show Chicago PD. There are other intriguing connections between Smollett and the brothers. Inside Edition found this video of Abel working out to a Jesse Smollett song. He even tagged Jussie on Instagram, Jussie Smollett. Ha ha, I love you. And look, this video shows one of the brothers doing handstands on a treadmill in the gym in Jussie Smollett's apartment building. Police say the two brothers are the shadowy figures caught on surveillance cameras the night of the alleged attack. Smollett spoke about the attackers in this ABC News interview and indicated they were white and shouted racial and homophobic slurs. I turn around and I see the uh, attacker uh, masked and he said this MAGA country punches me right in the face. Just hours after the alleged attack, the brothers flew to Nigeria. This is our Get Back Friday right here. This social media video shows Ola giving money to an injured teenager there. They flew back to Chicago two weeks later on Wednesday at 5.45 p.m. and detectives were waiting for them when they landed at O'Hare Airport. Police executed a search warrant and searched their apartment. A handwritten inventory shows these items cops confiscated. Bleach, black face mask, red hat, a script from Empire, laptop, and receipts. Here's Les Trent. The two suspects were brought here for questioning by Chicago detectives. Jesse Smollett also came here for further interviews about what he says happened to him. Police say the actor continues to cooperate and that he's being treated as a victim, not a suspect. But now questions are being raised about whether the reported attack was actually a hoax orchestrated by Smollett. According to one media report, Smollett staged the attack because his character was being written out of the show. Fox, which produces the show, condemned the report as patently ridiculous, saying that Smollett remains a core player on this very successful series, and we continue to stand by him.